cute horse? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> My bike life. As a young kid in Holland, the first thing you do is get on a bike. Honestly, I have a bike here in New York and I bike around. Yeah, it's my favorite thing to do. You, you get to see New York, but you're also, you know, working out. It's a good way to get around the city. I truly don't like to be alone. I just realized I always want people that I love around me. Just the fact that sometimes I'm just like super undecisive and I like can't choose. I feel like that's the Libra in me. I'm always like, yes, and then I'm no. And then, yeah, sometimes I would just want to be like, yes or no. My speaker or a book with me that I like to read. The Prophet by Khalil Gibran. I think that book is just life-changing. Ricardo Ticci for Givenchy. I think I was 17 at the time or 16 and I remember just being there backstage, you know, having Ricardo Ticci like tell me like you're opening the show. I was just like, oh my god, this is crazy. Yeah, that changed my whole life. I feel the most confident when I'm at home, when I have my music playing, I have my little candles, and I just feel good in like being in a space where there's just great energy. My mom makes the best soup, and the soup is called Harira, and it's a Moroccan soup. It's super thick, it's tomato based, it has chickpeas, sometimes it has meat. It's so delicious. Like, just thinking about it right now, I get hungry. That's gonna be Yasmin Ghori. She's a model from the 90s, and she's Pakistani, Muslim. And honestly, she's just my icon. It would be a dream if I could just work with her. This blazer that I have from Alaya, and I would wear it and I would keep it and I will give it to my children one day. Oh, and this dress actually. This is a vintage Alaya dress. Um Kultum, she's an Egyptian singer from the 60s. She just embodies like fierceness, power. It also just reminds me of like my family and just being back home, growing up listening to her, so, yeah. The homeland, that would be Morocco. I would go back to Morocco and just be there. <laughs>